and they can't even touch your base then. Look how much they're holding them back, they're not even moving from where they are, so if you started it at the middle of your channel, they will not come even further. And they won't be able to reach your turrets at the back then, and you're off. Yeah, I just don't get it. I don't get it at all, it's, it's totally a red box. When I preview it, it's totally green all the way through. When I preview, I can preview it all night. And it'll be all green all night. But as soon as I go to stream, because streaming uses your CPU and previewing done, it's a lot stronger strength and it just goes red or yellow or green. Red, yellow and green, red, yellow and green like that. And I've tried turning it up, down, I keep getting an eye encoding warning as well, but I've turned encoding right down. So I don't get it. I'm wondering if I have to upgrade to the newest one. But someone did that and said they couldn't understand it and went back to old one. And that one, uh, Ninja Ozzy. He ain't been in today actually, has he? No, I ain't seen Ninja today. So I've still got people who can come in, but they don't won't usually get here till after nine o'clock and then it's um Robot Apocalypse show tonight, so I don't know who's going to watch that as well. Between six and nine, that's when people start coming in in little droves at a time. And we're still on three at the moment, which I'm quite happy with. I usually like one an hour, so if I can get five in five hours that I've been streaming, then I'll be happy. And we've had five, we've had nine actually. But that was because we got a host from uh, Soda Border. See what I mean though, if you if you move your little, um, is it hurricane I think it is that, move that hurricane to where they were sat then V2H or V2C I think they were, because they were firing launchers weren't they, or were they firing missiles, if you sit it there anyway right and then when they send them little drones out they won't even get fit into your channel, They'll do the job, what they were just doing there, they'll hold them back. But don't do that for a player, because a player will just spin round in circles and just get you. Or send a, uh, what you call it in, 34 minute fleet damage. Yeah, is that the drones? Just a little bit of advice from me that I think would work. I don't even know what score I've got now, you know. Let's have a look at my score anyway. Oh, 19 million. So I need, what, 20, 21, 22. I need three more before I can do an 85 and then stream. Or I can do up to 28 on just 65s and keep streaming going a bit longer. That's not too bad though, 34 minutes. Is that only for drones? Because I ain't got another cane or an air better that fires drones out. I was going to do a fire bat one, but it would have took too long. And I had other things in plan at that time. 
My V2H were first. And then I went on to Punishers, as you know. And after that, I've got Rhinos to build. Actually, I'm looking at Neptune Fleet. I've been messing with buggies. Um, I'll show you fleet that I was thinking of building. See what you think of it. I know you've got some nice Neptunes, but I will just mess in with this one. Just give me a minute and I'll find it for you. I think this will be a kick-ass fleet, this. It's basically, though, a, a tank. Three, well, four strong Neptune after the tank. But it's a Neptune tank as well. That's what I did, didn't I? And have three more with ballistic on. Yeah. That's still over though, isn't it? I said I was going to put missiles on there. I haven't got a D5M, so it'd have to be D4M. Like that. This is what I were going to build in a Neptune fleet.
with new blades and new flank spars. I think I need four flank spars though, so I'm not sure whether that'll work yet. And I've also got one of them built with D53Ds on. So... I don't know yet. I do like the disruptor missile though. Although I've never used blade but I've seen it in action. It's not showing up. You have to do that. You might have to do that space thing. Take that space out. Yeah, it's not putting the link up, is it? So you'll have to. You may even be able to copy just the ship itself, not the link, into a browser after it's put the link in. Huggies might be down actually. Because there's no space in that. Wait a minute. Just try again. That's Huggies linked to it. But they don't seem to be working these links at the moment. I don't know. No, it doesn't seem to be working at all, does it? That's weird. Um. I don't get that. Unless Uggies is down or something like that. Because there's. Oh, yeah, there's still a space in between it. That's why. Yeah, it works if you take that space out. Copy the whole link. Paste it into it. Don't paste and go. Paste it into the browser and then take the space out again. It works. It might just be top one that didn't work, but the bottom one works if you do it that way. Let me check that and top one. Yeah, that's got a space in it as well, so that'd probably work and all. And it does, yeah. It's just because it's got a space in, that's all. When you put link in a chat. For some reason it puts a... I think it puts a space in because it wants Uggy's link at the top and then the ship underneath. That, that's the space you see, isn't it? Between the gate and the exclamation mark. So it might be just he's put, he's put like a space in between it so it puts the link at the underneath of the ship and the link at the top and goes purple then. <laughs> 